Hello everyone! This is Riku Keyblade Master, and my Animaniacs age research is complete! Let's start with Yakko. Yakko is the eldest of the Warner siblings, and he is 14 years old. Now, add 22 years onto that, however. So let's see. Let's see. 22 plus 14 would be 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33. 3, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42. That means he would have been 44 if he had age. But since he didn't, he is only 14. Now, let's move on to Wacko Warner. Wacko is the middle kid. Now, I googled it, and at first they said that the ages were not determined. However, given this current research that I was just given about their ages, um, this is like pretty much my guess on how old they actually would be if they had age. Which leads to a special theory, but that will be at the end of the video. Um... So, Wacko, he's 11. So you add 22 onto that. So 11 plus 11 is technically 22. 11 plus 11 plus 11, so that would be 33. Now, let's move on to Dot. Dot, or otherwise known as Princess Angelina. I'm not even gonna try to say all that. I'm not even gonna try. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, so it says that she is the youngest out of the Warner siblings and she is 10. So, had she been, um, able to age, she would technically be 32 because 10 years old, 10 more years she'd be 20, and 10 more years she'd be 32 more years and on to that. Now, for uh, a special treat, one of you guys, or at least a lot of you, actually, might be wondering, what is the deal? How come the Animaniacs haven't aged? Now, if you ask me, um, my guess is, this is gonna sound really crazy, but there haven't been my, many theories about this yet, as far as I know of. But I'm going to guess they were cryogenically frozen. And then placed in the Warner Tower when something had happened to the castle that their parents owned. And something happened to King Pushy. Now this is referring basically going all the way back to Wacko's Wish. Um... Mm. Man, do I even want to attempt to say her name? Oh my god. Miles, listen to three podcasts. You had two calls with your mom and one with your sister. Princess Angelina. And look at that. Belina. One pile up ahead, Gail. There's a meal for every moment at McDonald's. Enjoy a juicy McDonald's. Banana Cabana. Um, Beska the third? I know I butchered that. I'm sorry if I did. There's just no way of saying all of that and getting it right. <laughs> 
except with a lot of practice. But yeah, just let me know what you think about the ages that I managed to uh, Google search. I know my math isn't always the greatest as to how old they would actually be. But I'm sure you guys can do your own calculations and leave the answers in the comments below. But, as far as how they got cryogenically frozen and, or how they ended up back in the Warner Tower, you never know. They were probably, like I said, yeah, either cryogenically frozen or placed into a comatose state. But in a hyperbolic chamber where they never actually aged. Including when they got back into the Warner Tower. But let me know what you guys think in the comments. If you guys have any theories whatsoever, please, let's get this discussion started. I would be grateful to hear from you guys. I really would. Until next time, this has been Riku Keyblade Master. Comment, rate, subscribe to become a Keyblade wielder. Oh my goodness, this is like an amazing topic. I just thought I would do something like this and just, you know, try my hand at this, you know. As far as I know of, there aren't very many theories out there. Since the series started in 2018. But we'll have to see what's up. See you guys next time. Be safe, please. I would hate to think of what would happen if anything were to happen to any of you guys. Thank you guys so much for being there for me. I really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you.